Welcome to the tutorial on KFintech Virtual Meeting Platform. A single and unique platform with capabilities to integrate all proceedings of the general meeting. Accessible via any browser-based system like a handheld device, laptop or desktop. EAGM platform facilitates you with the ability to cast your vote. Post a query. Register as a speaker for the meeting and attend video conferences online. Now let me take you through the step-by-step -step process of the virtual meetings module developed by KFintech. In order to access all the features kindly use the link emeetings.kfintech.com. Please ensure that you have good internet bandwidth to avoid disconnections and disturbances. Note that certain activities on the landing page are available only during the dates mentioned in the notice shared by the company. Once on the EAGM webpage, you have the option to log in using the user ID and password, which is the voting credentials or via an OTP, that will be triggered to the mobile number registered with your folio. By default, the option to use voting credentials will be active. In case you wish to log in via OTP process, please opt for mobile OTP and click on the circle next to it. From the drop-down, select the meeting you wish to attend and enter the registered mobile number. Click on Send OTP. Please note that the meeting in the drop-down will only be available post the cutoff date for the event. Post OTP validation, you will be required to choose the folio, in case of multiple folios registered with the same mobile number. If you wish to log in with the e-voting credentials use the feature in the webpage to log in. On the e-meeting webpage, you will have six options to choose from. Upon clicking the remote e-voting button, the application will open the e-voting website. For security reasons, you will be required to use the login credentials again and complete the process in order to vote. Password change menu appears when you log in for the first time. You will be required to mandatorily change the default password. Follow the guidelines. On successful login, the system will prompt you to select the event. Choose the event from the drop-down provided and click on the company name listed below. The voting screen will appear. Here you can cast your vote on the resolutions and click submit. System will prompt to confirm once again, and on clicking OK your vote will be submitted. Members holding multiple folios or DMAT accounts may choose to vote differently for each folio or DMAT account. You will be redirected to the home screen, where you will have the option to continue with voting for other shareholdings or you can log off from this page. If user has forgotten the existing password or wishes to reset the existing password, they can use the feature Forgot Your Password on the eVoting homepage and follow the instructions. In order to post your queries, please access emeetings.kfintech.com webpage and log in with the desired options stated at the beginning of the tutorial. On the landing page, click on Post Your Queries tab. Click on the event for which you wish to post a query. Please enter email ID, mobile number and mention the query details within 500 characters. Kindly avoid any special characters. Post clicking on Submit button, you will be provided with a confirmation message on the screen. To go back to the previous page, click on Home. On the landing page the option to register self as a speaker for an event will be available. Click on the Speaker Registration tab. Select the event of the company from the list. Please read the company notice for the AGM carefully before carrying out the process of speaker registration. You will be provided with a confirmation message on the screen. You will be required to fill in your mail ID, mobile number and city. If the provision to upload a pre-recorded video, max 50 megabytes, or record a video, 3 minutes, is available, kindly avail the option, or else post entering the mandatory details click on submit. Upon successful submission of the details, you will get a confirmation message on the screen. You can click on the home tab to go back to the landing page. In order to join the live meeting, please click on the video conferencing tab located on the landing page. Kindly note, that the event will only be available 15 minutes prior to the scheduled time and date, as mentioned in the notice. Select the company name and click on the video icon to join the meeting. To ensure smooth functioning, kindly ensure that the pop-up blocker of your browser is turned off, and you have a good bandwidth while accessing the live event to avoid disconnection. In case you are disconnected from the live event, please repeat the process to rejoin the event. Click on Join Meeting Post reading the disclaimer. Application will perform the system test to ensure that webcam, microphone and system speakers are in sync. Kindly allow accesses wherever required or prompted by the application. Click on green thumb icon in order to be placed in the VC. Regular shareholders will be able to see and hear the entire proceedings. Check speaker volume in order to increase or decrease audio. 
As a shareholder attending the AGM, you will be able to view the proceedings, vote in case you have not yet cast it, ask a question via text option placed at the bottom of the screen, and share your feedback about the meeting platform. Shareholders registered as speakers will be able to unmute themselves, share the webcam if they desire to do so, and interact with the distinguished members post the announcement by chairman. In order to vote during the meeting, click on the thumbs up icon on the bottom left of your screen. This will open the Insta poll page. Proceed to vote. Post submission you will be provided with an on-screen confirmation. We sincerely hope that the tutorial has given you all the required information needed. Before we say thank you, here is a quick recap. For e-voting, access the webpage evoting.kfintech.com. For meetings and related activities, please access emeetings.kfintech.com. For shareholders who need support, please access the Investor Support Center by accessing ris.kfintech.com. For all your queries, kindly reach out to us on einword.ris at kfintech.com. Once again, thank you for the patient listening and greetings from kfintech.